Hello Internet, this here is a uh, in-depth look or a deeper dive into uh, the rigid carrying case. Uh, the reason for the video is I picked up the MPC Live when it first came out and I've been using it live for uh, gigs and your carry case options fall under two categories, expensive or overgrown laptop bags. And uh, there's a lot of chatter online on uh, the MPC Live, Akai Groups on Facebook about uh, creative alternatives to the either the laptop bag or the uh, um, $200 SKB case with the uh, pick apart foam and so the search was on and one day there we were walking through our local big box hardware store and this guy popped out and it's sold as a toolbox really um, but if you take all the bits out from the inside and put your new bits on the inside uh, in, um, what you're left with is a pretty darn tough uh, hard case for not too much money. This was 30 bucks at Home Depot, in my case. Um, and I just wanted to take a couple minutes to just get, uh, talk about the pros and cons. So, uh, just to get a look at it, there it is. It's tough as nails. I mean, it, it it just is. I don't know if you saw what's going on with the hinges back here, but that is some crazy stuff. Uh, the uh, injection molded, I guess, plastic is also just, it's heavy duty. And nice big meaty beefy handle. Uh, I'll just get it out of the way. I could live without the orange. I could live without all the orange. I could live without the tractor uh, Tonka truck styling. But um, this isn't about that. This is about keeping your MPC safe. So um, this is, I think, the only metal, except for that hinge back there. On the thing are these clasps. Satisfying, chunky. There's actually a padlock hasp on each one. I personally don't know what the padlock hasp is for just going to steal the whole case um, I didn't know I was gonna like this but it's just super easy to pick up oh, look there's a drum machine in there uh, this is probably supposed to be some sort of dust and moisture let's call it resistant probably not proof um, but that's what it's there for and the uh, drum machine fits perfectly comfortably inside um, this foam here Kind of a work in progress. This is like that egg crate stuff that doesn't uh, do much for sound dampening, but it might do a little bit for shock dampening. So that's what's going on in here. When you first get the thing, I'll take this out. None of this is in here, of course. In fact, what you actually have in there is these little plastic divide, uh, little plastic cups like this. One, two, three. One, two, three. I'm using the one for holding your rack module right now. The divider sits in here. The divider sits in here. And then there's this thing, which is in the top. Uh, but this pries out super easy with a flathead screwdriver, revealing the space below. These are actually meant to come out. And then uh, cutting out some foam and putting it in here was uh, just couldn't have been easier. So that's that. Uh, I did take a shot at trying to peel the sticker off. I don't know if you can see if the uh, how hard it was to get the sticker off is any indication of the build quality. Uh, I suppose that's a good sign. Uh, it's. Gosh, I want to say if it's light or heavy, and I really don't have an opinion on that. It's uh, substantial, but it doesn't like it's not like shockingly heavy. It weighs what you'd think it would weigh, and then it weighs what you'd think it would weigh with a drum machine in it. With a drum machine in it, um, little fringe benefits. You can actually buy a bunch of these, and they're stackable. This bit here, which serves as a handle, is uh, also used to lock them. So if you buy a bunch of them, you can actually stack them up and lock them together. 
And the other thing I kind of had my eye on when I bought it was, could you set the drum machine on top and use it as a table? And the answer is yes. So, uh, gosh, I think that's probably all there is to say about a plastic box, but hopefully I've said it. If not, uh, feel free to ask questions in the thing. I don't care if you like, comment, or subscribe because I have a day job. And uh, happy, uh, happy travels.